Hello, my name is Luis Antonio, and I'm going to introduce you to space radiation and medical countermeasures, which was a project my teammates and me work on this summer. First of all, an astronaut can face a lot of risk in deep space missions. One of them is space radiation, which consists of solar electromagnetic spectrum and charged particles derived from different sources in space. Solar electromagnetic spectrum is not, is not as dangerous as charged particles, since it is easier to prevent from reaching astronauts. The main sources of charged particles are three, which are galactic cosmic rays, that is ionizing radiation coming from outside the solar system, solar particle events, that are high energy protons coming from the sun, and solar wind. So why is space radiation so dangerous? Ionizing radiation can interact directly on cellular molecules or indirectly via free radicals. These free radicals are called reactive oxygen species, which can lead to stress in body systems and also complex DNA damage caused by oxidation. So if an astronaut goes to a deep space mission to Mars during three years, he will be exposed to 1,200 millisievers. One millisiever is equivalent to two, three X-rays. So that will be an amazing amount of damage. We need to protect them. So there are medical countermeasures. These are divided in three categories, radio protectors, radio mitigators, and radiation therapeutics. Radio protectors are administered before exposure, radio mitigators before obvious symptoms, and radiation therapeutics enhance tissue regeneration. Thanks for your time and attention.